almost 8 p.m. I'm going to finish up. Just to rest for a moment. And then we'll be ready to start for it. All right, here, here we go. Yeah, I'm almost getting ready to it, all right? It's going to be much quicker. All right, it is 8 p.m. for this Saturday, and my eyes can go straight, and then I, that's straight, but it is. It's my hair. Everything go. All right, it is 8 p.m. My name is Kyle, and I'm waiting for the CBS New Journalism, David Bagnell. Yeah, he will be able to join me on the Zoom video meeting for those Zoom video communications. So while we're waiting for it, I'm going to finish resting the posters on social media, and then I'm going to get back to work for that, for Dr. Rosen. So let's go ahead to put all things around. And we're going to get started. All right, so let's talk about Dr. Rosen. So he has been diagnosed about the battling of COVID-19. Now, when we also want to be a countdown, how you remember this about, you know, just important case, fragile leader, and that's why it happens. Well, I'll be able to look up real quick and have something for conversation as it much was quite quite tough like it like it before then you know I remember when I met with Donna Rosens for for a long time ago or probably last time um, well it's a some properly probably I guess but it would I Certainly, and certainly for 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 once though, and pardon, pardon with that, I'm gonna go to get finding for those posts. I'm just gonna be back in a moment. All right, I'm back, and I see what Michael Lambert is here. I'm gonna go to him again, and while we're while we're here, and hey, Michael, are you here? Hello, Kyle. Hey, how are you doing today? Kyle, I get the feeling that most people show up in your meetings. I I always have for remembering Donald Rosen's. It all right, so I'm still waiting for David Bendo on the CBS News Journalism that he has. I hear him. Okay, I'd like to see if others will show up or they were busy or something. All right, so let's talk about Donald Rosen's that he just got passed away from about last June 25th. So I'm gonna show you what this post is right over here. Now here's what that says. We are heartbroken to share the news that longtime Sprout participant Donna Rosen has passed away following a battle with COVID-19. Donna was involved with Sprout for over three decades and participated in over 1,000 trips and activities starting in the early days of Sprout founding. Truly a Sprout original, he was a sweet nat natural man, was a playful sense of humor and a love for good conversation. Our confidence go out 
to all the many people who know and love Donald. He will be sorely missed. Oh, Donald. I think I remember him. Oh, I see. He got the virus and died from it. Oh, man. Sorry to hear, Donald. Right. That, that was about two weeks later. And yeah. I hardly, I had some, I hardly see, I hardly seen him during Sprout, but I think I remember him. I understand he got the virus and died from it. Miss, but I guess he couldn't. Uh, but I get it wasn't his fault. Okay, sometimes you, you survive from the virus or you die from it. Okay, it happens. I already hear. But I hope he lives a good life in heaven. I'm gonna show you for this slideshow for this one, like he that he is, and also he usually went his free vacation trip or any any other vacations that's his partners and you know why 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 he hang out to and also he went to Beaumont Lames in Times Square just about every month that he loves to play bowling mm. and we have here this is what this partner uh, having a party and for that one, and I see what Santiago just wrote down in the comments below, that he's and he's and he wrote about this dancing with Lily Kramer. Is that you? Who, Kyle? Who's that? Next, to Donald. That's Lily Kramer. Okay, is she a friend of him? Uh, well, firstly, the one in the SAS or the individuals, hopefully, that that she lives in Honolulu, California. Wait, she's from California, and she was, an, and Don was at a party. He, 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 he was attending a party, and he made a friend, I guess. Wow. Just like a party. And she's from, and, now, and she's from California. Impressive. Very impressive. And you can see Don was smiling. They're very, 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 very happy to, to see. It's hopefully very grateful. And he always loved his trip. Like, like I said, I'm guessing like talking about 60s, 70s, 80s, or 90s on his age. But, and I see Rayo just sent to this on this message that she was saying he was, he was born in on his date of birth. And I'm gonna give you just guys for just a quick, quick close up. It's, it's about here. And I said for the what was Don Rosenboy and what his day is birth, and she said November twenty fourth, nineteen fifty four. Hmm, that's okay, Kyle. Um, we don't need to. I don't need to know um about the uh, the past stuff about Donald, okay? Because I'll miss because I'll, I'll start to miss him more. I, all I know is he lived a good life with Sprout, and unfortunately, he couldn't. He lost the battle with the virus, and I understand he did have a good time with Sprout. Yep. One of his trips, I'm sure Kelsey, you and the rest of the group, the app, that's all of you. Disability rights are human rights. You guys have been busy. Donald, you lived a good life. So here's Donald. Uh, I'm, so, I'm sorry. I'm sorry you couldn't remember. I'm sorry he couldn't face. I'm sorry. He, I'm sorry he couldn't defeat the virus. Don't worry, Donald. Sprout will never forgive. Forget you. Forget you. I almost said the wrong word. Forgive and forget. That's a phrase. But right. the word I'm trying to say is forget. No one will ever forget you, Donald. And so Donald's right over here. Here's what Kelsey, here's Catherine, here's Emily, here's James, and here's Friends Willard, and here's myself. And and I see what the comments are. Here's what Santiago just wrote down. And he, he wrote Disability, this. Disability Pride Parade. Right. Disability Pride Parade Summer 2019 with Catherine Pritchard, Emily Singer, Kelsey DeRathful, my that's me for myself, James M and Friends Miller. I hope, I, uh, I, hope, I hope Rob will do something special for him in the future to make sure he won't be forgotten. Also, Catherine just wrote, what a lovely day you will be Miss Donald. Also, Frank Miller wrote this. This is a classic masterpiece photo of one of my activities, the Disability Pride of Summer 2019, in memory of the late Donald Rosen, a Sprout legend. Let's see what the more relatives, but... Let's give for more slideshows. And Donald loves to do for the Playboy for the conga line on, you know, just partner on like a, like a party. And you can see he's waiting for the New York Yankees hat for the baseball player. 
and in my shirt for Donald just loves to do for the conga line on the party for the partner. And here's 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 what we have holding for his portrait and to show what for those flashback. And he, he you can see he can smile about his portrait. You can see that poly up on on his right hand. And yeah, knowing Sprout, this is a huge slideshow to make sure Donald will never be forgotten. Yes, a good slideshow. Lots and lots and lots and lots and lots and lots of pictures. Lots of pictures. Yeah, that's a lot. That's a little more than that. Yeah. Yes, just, Sprout. Yes, Sprout. You will never ever forget Donald. So I'm gonna see what Nadia yeah, just posted on about Donald. It it, it will be here, here, but I'm gonna find Nadia oh. on Instagram. Excuse me, Kyle. It appears my grandmother is calling me. I'll be back. I'll be right back. All right, I'll wait for you. All right, so while we're waiting for Michael Lemon, I'm gonna find with Nadia's photo and but actually I'm gonna I'm gonna use this tag for Nadia Arts. Here we are. As you may know about this one. I'm gonna give you for the video about Donald and to wait for the Nadia's posted and, and see what it looks like. And have, having had been through, but we could get back to Michael Lemon. Now, as you may know about while we're waiting for CBS News Journalism, David Bank know that he's on his way to join me on Zoom. I'm gonna see him where he at. Uh, you know about David Bagno on CBS News. So I'm gonna go ahead and type um, David Bagno. It's Kyle. I live in NYC. Came here in Staten Island. I'm just gonna give this for what to send him. Are you going to join me on Zoom? Radio meeting? It's 8 p.m. in New York City. I'll tell him while, while he's ready for it. And hope David's gonna be on. So far, so good. And it's hopefully about about Dino Rosens. And I hope he's sort of things that you you could imagine. And I'm just get back to the first speaker view. And while we're waiting for Michael Lemon to talk to his grandmother and he'll be back for the Zoom video meeting as I know this before it's kind of like um what do you call this one? It is it's still, still like a little sunny day or half. And I'm good, trying to wait. I'm still waiting for David and he will be able to join me. Like he was talking about in Puerto Rican. And as you may, you, if you want to see David Bagnos, you can follow him on Instagram, Facebook, even on CBS News Online. Like I just already, Talk, uh, talk about here, or probably you may know him. Like, like I said, for 48 hours on CBS News. It just like, it seems like upcoming on it. 
Okay, some help. So I so I thought David Brando that he leaves with a national correspondent for CBS this morning, every every Monday through Friday. Also, he has his dog, you know, on this, you know, the dog poodle, toy poodle, Paddington. But it's Paddington. But it is. So if you're interested about David Brando, you can follow him on Instagram, also on Twitter, and, and Facebook to find even the YouTubers. I'm going to put the link below if you, if you want to see it. Or actually, you can also try it. You know, you can also try to find him. It is completely up to you. And you make sure about wearing the ALU face mask, you know, just cover with your nose and mouth. And as you may, as you may see about for the, you know, working on it for CBS News. Now, now for that on the CBS Evening News with Noah O'Donnell and for, for Monday through Friday night. Talk about here for the COVID-19 and it's still beyond for the pandemic. But it might seem that just a just a little while. And it kind of it kind of be like a you know it's just an important ways about Donald Rosen's um like I just always remember that I remember with Donald Rosen's. So let me just get it fine here. What and I have to here to post to see. I but, come back. Oh, hey Michael, you're back. Yes, um, yeah, it took a while. Sorry about that. And uh, so Kyle, um, I feel uh, bad that others haven't showed them to your meetings. Apparently. All right. What What do you What do you call about this? Yeah, you may not. You just you done something special for Donald. Oh, oh who, who, who was one of the very important people of Sprout? I felt bad that he lost the battle with the virus. And some of us Sprout people are missing our trips and stuff. But what can we do? I feel like we're locked in here for a long time. In our homes, I mean. Here's what I found with Nadia's posted on Instagram that I want to show you. And here's what he is that, that he does wants to say. Just listen to this. Not, Nadia did something nice for Donald. Yeah, the rest of Sprout will make sure Donald will never be forgotten. He may have lost a battle with the virus, but Sprout will make sure he'll never be forgotten. And they've done something nice for him on Instagram and Facebook. Yeah, some nice videos. Yeah, you hear me, followers of Facebook and Instagram? Make sure to look at these. An innocent individual, well, actually, a long time Sprout individual who had been with Sprout for a long time and he lost the battle with the virus. So I hope you check these out to show that Sprout will make sure that Donna will never, ever be forgotten. Right. Now, here's, here's Nadia right next to Don, Donald over here. That, that, you know, Nadia loves Dono, that he loves to come on this trip. And also, Donald just went here for his vacation with his father. Just now, you now this is what it always about that she was about so sad to hear about the passing of Donald due to the COVID nineteen report, and as you may know about. Here's what Ingrid wrote about. Here's one, and, he, and she wrote, "We'll miss him." And I see this will reply for it. And and she said he was the absolute sweetest. Love to pay hi. Look at all those comments on Instagrams. And probably one I want to tell you about. How was Dono feels? And it's it's poorly, but I can see what Ingrid just posted this one. And I just want to show you something about 
So let me see what that is. It's just like in the Mermaid Parade that he just always went like like Brook like blocks in Brooklyn. That um hopefully it's kind of Donald's gonna be old enough. <laughs> you know, like I said, I'm guessing that it looks like he'll be at his age of you know like 80s or 90s, whatever. Now he just now he just right behind here on the cherry blossom went to the you know Brooklyn Botanical Garden in Prospect Park. Now in which is about this one for a spa participant Donald passed away this week. He lost his battle of COVID-19. It is so sad. Rest in peace, Donald. Picture taken at last year's trip at Brooklyn Botanical Garden. But it is Brooklyn Botanical Garden in Prospect Park. And you may know about Anisha Anahan's 03 wrote about this one. It's so beautiful. Also, the other username on the Instagram, and I see what Han Nake Sanji says wrote about what rendering, what do you call this word? I think this is the word is, hold on, not, not you. I'm talking to the Zoom meeting. Stirk in a stirk word, stirk boy, Ingrid. But see what those. Anyway, now I already, I already concerning for a child. Yep. And I guess that that's the time to mention Instagram looks difficult to handle. That's a lot. No, those are excellent pages and pictures that people had to prepare in order to look at and stuff. Really? Yeah, I know you have Instagram, bud. I thought it was difficult for you to handle, but obviously you can handle it. I'm sure it does. Why does why does Instagram look so difficult to handle? Um, you could you could post you could post it anything you want after you already took the pictures. It is completely up to you. So awesome. If you say so, Sprout did some nice Instagram posts for Donald. Um Quite sure everything can post it on any social media. Just like, you know, every everyone who can post any categories, any topics, etc. Cetera, etc. Cetera. I hear you. Social media is difficult. Um you never you never see about the Instagram, right? Huh? You never seen about Instagram, right? Never seen Instagram? What do you mean? Um, you never seen about Instagram or you should you should make your you should apply to or actually you could you can create your own Instagram username. Okay. I'm thinking about it because Instagram looks very difficult, even though you have Instagram and you have a lot of followers following you. Right, I just up to about 479 subscribers on YouTube. Yeah. And, no, and I don't want to say this to your viewers, Kyle, but I'm really envious of you. You have lots more subscribers than me because of your work. I can never do as good as work as you can, you know. I want to be as good. I want to be that good with my work. And, and you've done something nice for Donald. I'm proud of you, though. Yet, I'm still envious of your work. Well, I'm sure really proud about the memory of Donald. And hopefully, you know, all staff and individuals are going to miss Donald Rosen. But we wish we want to pray him. Mm -hmm. And people who ever saw this news about COVID-19 just still are here. Like, I already wrote about, just, just in case, uh, Wuhan is already clean right now. And the rest of the country still needs to be clean to protect the coronavirus. As soon as possible, make sure to wear the in-loop face mask, face mask, 
disposable gloves, also the hand sanitizer. Yeah, I know. Everyone's doing the best they can to survive the virus, but the virus is still winning technically. And I hate to see what will happen in 2021 if the virus is still taking over the world. Like I hear about the the Japanese to rescheduling for the Summer Olympics in Tokyo for next year in 2021. Everything got postponed for 2021. 2020 turned into a nightmare due by the virus. It's not the 2020's fault, it's the virus fault. Okay, no one could no one could have predicted it became a global pandemic. Nobody. So you want to make sure to watch the news about the COVID-19 pandemic. I have, and I've seen enough nightmares. Trust me, Kyle. All right, trust you. So anyway, um, hopefully I'm still waiting for CBS News journalism, David Bagnell, that he's on his way to join me on Zoom radio communication for his for their meeting. How did you manage how did you manage to acquire him? I didn't mean to interrupt you. Continue. Oh, all right. I'm gonna continue on. So I'm still waiting for David Bagnell that he's on his way on Zoom radio meeting for this communication that he works on the CBS News. Like like he that he is the lead national correspondent for CBS this morning. He also worked about here for CBS this morning, even the CBS Evening News with Noah O'Donnell, also for every Saturday, Saturday, 48 hours. Like I can see about here, yeah, like he talks about in Puerto Rico in like he always learns. And also, and I see what David Bagnos has his pet dog, the pet dog, that, that he has, uh, you know, I'm gonna sh give you just to show you about those dogs right here. This is Paddington Barucha. Right, it's just like this. He has dogs, gotcha. And isn't that cute? And I'm gonna show you this picture of you know, David Bagnell just pull it up, uh, pull it up here, and here's David Bagnell wearing his face mask to take taking them, but and and his partner Germany right over here, right next to David. And I'm going to give you just guys so just a, a close look. I'll just I'm just giving you for this moment. And I'm going to see what the picture of here, David and his dog. Right here. That, that's the one. Oh, that, that, sorry, sorry. Another oh. good picture. Oh, you're not a good picture, but, but it's all right. Uh, uh, I'm just going to give it a little more. Again, another good picture, but I hope the dogs are obedient. Hopefully, it would it would be it. Now, if you never heard, if you never seen about David Bedell, you can you can follow him on his social media: Facebook, Twitter, even Instagram. And I'm gonna give you just guys. Uh, just uh, to show this picture about David Bagnell on CBS News that he just always works for for in in that case it, it just it just beyond you see what the the screenshot is but let me get this going here for about here but yep that he there you are so this is the CBS News journalism David Bagnell. I'm just give you just a might be a close up. That this is what he works on on his, on the CBS News in CBS Broadcast Center in New York. I hear you. So he works for CBS News, but Kyle, don't you think it's impossible to get someone like him to be here? You could you could always uh, want to see him, or you could also want to talk to him if you can. But 
doesn't really matter. But it is completely up to you. Yeah, but Kyle, trust me, take this from me. It'd be impossible to get someone like him um, to be here, trust me. Uh, when you uh, when you're a, when you're a very important person or even in the high class, uh, it can be very difficult to get someone like that right here. So for this story, um, when you doing your work about living with artists and with Michael by Michael Lemon, you can you can make you can make your own stories about about the remembering David Donald Rosen. I w I wait I. I wish, trust me, I wish I could, but unlike you, I'm not able to do something like that. You do better work than I do. Really? Yes, much better work than me, and that's why I'm envious of you. I wish I could do as good work as you can, or any other experts that are better than me. So remember, um, you can make your own stories about the Sprout participant, Donald Rosen, about, about the trip, that he that he's a natural man, that he's happy, that he's a rel a relative, he also he is a special, even he's a, a pers a personal life, just like that. And so Michael, if you want to share your share your own stories about Donna Lawson's about battery with COVID-19. It is completely up to you that you want to do that on the Living with Autism by Michael Lemon. I don't know how I can do that, Kyle. You've already taken care of that in your part. So when you're done, make sure to post it on YouTube. And then I'm going to see it on the notification bell on YouTube. Kyle, I'm not able to do something like that, OK? All I do is speak in front of a camera if I do something like that. You did better work. All right. Are you sure I did by my work? I do. Yeah, I do. I wouldn't know how to do something like that. I mean, I wouldn't mind doing something nice for Donald because I feel bad that he lost to the virus. But I'm not able to do something like that. I wish I could, though. But you'll see how that goes. All right. Well, I just remind Michael Lemon to make a video about his about the story of Donald Roses too, but he didn't he don't know why. But Michael will see how it goes. And when he's done here, he'll be posted on YouTube like I said. And he'll we'll see how we'll see how it is. Then I can see it on the notification bell on YouTube. And he says better than better than me. Why if you say so? And I'm gonna see what David Benton was at, but but he but he didn't reply that on Facebook messages. But I'm see I'm gonna wait for him as soon as possible uh, to making sure. Well, actually, I'm gonna give him to. I hope this might be going to work. Well, it is about 8.35 p.m. in the evening for this week. Um, hopefully, they will be, will be on, you know, just, just like a stop in traffic. So, so that he, so Donald Rosen has died on June 25th, 2020. So, so, so this is here, like I said, where Saturday, July 11th in New York City and Los, in New York City, 8 p.m., Los Angeles, 5 p.m. Sunday, July 12th, in Japan, 9 a.m. In Sydney, 10 a.m. And I'm quite sure they'll... Kyle, you were saying? Um, yeah, I'm just, I'm just wanting to make sure they will be 
able to join me on Zoom video meeting for those communication. He'll be on his way. Okay, you say he's on his way. Not Andrei. Well, we'll see if he shows up. And if not, it was just like I thought. It's impossible to get someone like him on here. No offense. I wish I could do that. Trust me. But it wouldn't be possible for me. They might say no. But they probably wouldn't say it to you. You're good. Right, I'm good. And we have to make sure they will be, will be on here or maybe not. But we'll, we'll continue to chat around. Like I said here, I just posted on the Instagram stories that I just always do mine. And hopefully, hopefully it does looks. Let me see where that is. Oh, here we are. So you see here, I'm going to interview with C Res New Shirtson, David Brego, and even other Scroll staff together. Hopefully it was. Where did David where did David go? He might be took too long, but we'll have to see. I knew I knew I saw David Regno was on Zoom video meeting and on, on on his on his social media. But what it, how do I see him? See what David Bagner was at. I hope he's on. Just, 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 just want to show and tell. It can be like it. Hmm. See what up to about eight thirty-eight in the evening. And I'm gonna try uh hold up. See who else are they going to going to be able here. Let me try uh William or any other sprouts staff. Going to be on this one. Uh, get this one here. Hey William, it's coming. Hold on, hold on, just a moment. I'll, I'll be on. I'll, I'll be here. Back on. Michael Letman and I are going to talk about the men, the, the memory, yeah. Uh, We'll see where how it goes. And then I'm gonna go check with Laura. It's going here. All right. Hope hope it hope it should be on. And. Let's see what that, that, that they require that. I want to make sure to, to get on and see what can I get to send. I'm, I'm sure they go to find me for it. <clears throat> All right then. Let me try Aaron. Hope that he is he's going to be here. I I think I saw Aaron before the last Wednesday. 
but it has to, has to. I'm just gonna give him for the supplies, but I just already made them. Now, when I, what I just made about Down the Roses, it's, um, I'm gonna give you just shot for those pic for the picture or I'm gonna make I'm gonna make that real quick and and like like we all just went about uh you know just went to the you know in the Scottish Turkish parade for for that way. Took a selfie look. And actually, I'm going to just give you guys for, for uh, you know, have a, have something that I want to get it with. And well, I'm going to give, I'm going to find minds of that, about Don Rose's white fish show for that to, to show and tell. I'm gonna see where I can just a just a just a mom for okay, I'm gonna see where where were the picture of the Donna Rosen that is on about hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Nice. And what is that? I'm gonna see what uh, February eighth. I, I, right? I guess February eighth. It is for the last February. 8th. All right, here we are. I'm just giving you for the share screen on Zoom. Like last February eighth. Now we just went on to here to you know went to the urban glass. And another Instagram post. Right. And last February 8th that we went to the Urban Glass Studio shows this talk back that for this art project. And here's why I'm right behind Dono down here. And he also here's Dono, here's Sarah, Michael Eisenstein, Ivan, Maleka. Uh, who else is there? Sees, um, Casey, Franz Miller, and then James Dugan. And I'm gonna just want to show you all those talk backs that we I uh, like. Let me did, let me just you always guys remember to they went on the oven glass but I'm gonna show more where. What I just find here for Donna Wilson's and see what the Donald's looks at. It's I I thought I thought I probably that uh you know like I like I see what is 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 important as a way to to look up with Donna Wilson's. Oh, and it, hey, I see it. All right, I, I see there's more for that. But I'm gonna give you for the, sh the share screen sh and shot back for that. Now, so last last December 16, 2019, that this is what it goes for. Now we went to the New York Botanical Garden that, I just wanna show you for this one. Here's James Dugan, there's Ganache, Ernesto, Franz Miller, Caesar, Casey, Mikey, that's myself, and right here in the middle of Donna Rosen. And hopefully, I just always 
show up to save with Dono and for this picture of this flashback. And I wrote about for the description below on Instagram. And I wrote about here, we're, we're behind the holiday train at NYBG. And I can see what they have here, but hold up just guys, I'm gonna give you just more ahead about Donna Rosen that I, I just posted for mine. It's I post so many of those like probably every day or one day at a time for it. And I'm gonna have oh, I'm just gonna scroll more down here. Hopefully, Donald's almost like same age of 80s or 90s where we were doing for the guessing game. It, it, has, it has just uh, got to make sure to see what Donald's at. Hmm. Can't be so shy. Uh, we're almost getting right to here, but hang on, people. David, I'm still waiting for you to join me on Zoom video communication. <clears throat> Pardon me. I'd like to see if others would show up, unlike myself. Really? No, no, yeah, that didn't come out right. I meant to say, I shut I showed up. Why didn't everyone else showed up? You uh, you sent you sent the word to this meeting to a lot of people, even throughout people, and only I showed up. Hmm. Sounds interesting. Very interesting. <laughs> but why not? Why not Don Wilson? But who who loves Don Wilson? But I think Spout knows about Don Wilson. But Hopefully, that's going to be on this story. I'm quite sure I have just a few more pictures of Donald's. It's got to be somewhere. Hmm. I could have said some good words about Donald in this. I know they could have. That's okay. Proceed. Yeah, I just see one here. And here's what photo by Kelsey that went on here for the Scottish Church in Parade. Yeah. <laughs> and hold up here, I'm like I wear for the orange hood, hoodies on it, that, that I kept recording out, outside of that at the, you know, in, right next to it behind the Rockefeller Center. And here's what Kelsey and this, Michael Einstein and there's Donald's and that he has here for hanging with my guys. That's, that's what Kelsey just wrote this one on her stories. I'm going to see what else about with Donna Rosen's and it's quite weird, but almost there. But I hope probably it does. Like, I'm going to see what Donna went here for, for me. It's, uh, see what Donna's going to on here. Okay, can you want to come on that? And, you know, it's, have, have you seen about, uh, you know, he might be, looks like he's old enough for that. Sometimes, uh, it's, it, it, it's, it's, sometimes, uh, some part of, part of this, uh, you know, life in heaven, and it, it it could it could always remember what has about love has about any for the uh you know what what you call this uh, it's um you know it's kind of uh, kind of as uh having thoughts or any you can probably probably see or or hopefully it does was but. Well, anyway, I I just always remember, like, oh yeah, um, what where should I went to? I went to about here on the trip 
probably for last autumn season. It is about here to uh, uh hold up, hold up. I, I have to look up here. Oh yeah. Morris Jewel Madison tutorial is about for the Roger Morris. But it is. Like and I see Donna Wilson went to the Morris Jumal Madison to see about the Roger Morris for, for this history. And also went to the Statue of Liberty and the Ellis Island on this tour in the Hudson River. So if you have, if you want to say something about the Zoom video meeting, any questions, let me know in the comments below. You can see on the, ch the chat, the, ch the chat button right down here on the Zoom video live streams. If you want, it is, you can do that whatever you can. And I hope to see on here, it's kind of, kind of, kind of got, I'm trying to make sure to test with Williams and Laura, everyone else is on here. Hopefully he's, um, like kind of, kind of be on it, but that is just the one about with the relationships is here. And, and what's on this see for those this stories? And it, it's kind of bit and kind of can be further or uh, whatever. And hopefully he'll do his work for about yet. They were most. Dot the um, oh, what do you call this? Oh, but CBS News Journalism, some David Bang now doing his own work about you know jobs and then whatever. It is about eight fifty three in the evening. Um, like I said, about for only under or over over two hours about here. Mm, Kyle. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, how can I point this out? All right. Uh, All right. Go on. What do you want to say? Uh, I well, I'm gonna. Excuse me. Hey, I'm just gonna wait for him. Now, I, I want to tell you about this one. Like the history about Donald Roses about just any things about the fun activities. It's kind of kind of beyond. What I give you for for the. Uh, what do you call this for the Morris? Um, I'm going to see what I just always say about for my post. It's kind of, kind of beyond. Wow. Oh yeah. I was, I was going to say I feel bad for the unemployment rate rising up lately. Hey, do you have you had work experience like I did before? Uh, uh for example, um, work example for example for this, uh, you know, like any businesses, any like, uh, you know, just just how how they turn out for it. And, very important. Well, um, okay. Well, okay. I'll tell you this first. Oh, excuse me. Continue. I'll be right back. Okay. Oh, uh, right. So I'm just gonna while we're waiting for Michael, I'm just gonna find here what we have. Um, just see with the previous. Sorry, or actually, I'm gonna give you for just memories. I'm not gonna give you for guys. And 
I'm sure is on. Uh, while we for the uh, here. Continue. Uh, all right, I'll continue. Right. And hang on, hang on. I'm just gonna give that for. All right. All right, I'm just back on here. I just want to give you guys to show you that I just posted on that we went here for the Morris Joel Madison tutorial for about like last September 21st. Is that that's my came here to visiting for, and I'm gonna give you for those. Um, I'm gonna give you guys for password for you are or trying to be trying to be see out that. That goes with, and right here. That so, what are you waiting wait to see for Donna Moses? I just already recorded this on my camcorder, and there we go. So, this is what Donna Moses just went here to the Morris Jamal Madison. I just already recorded this here about, you know, about that time. It was right behind here for Malika, Ernesto, and then Sergey, Dina, and then also Vincent. Kyle. Yeah. This is one of your videos. That's one of my videos. How did you get? How did you get a video like this? It's long, like a movie. Um, this is what I use it for. I click here for the theater, or if you can, you can do that for the multi. You know, multi you know. Many players. No, I mean, no, no, I meant it. Not that. What? When did you get this? I mean, when did you record this? I mean, last September twenty first. It was. It was at the Morris Jamal Madison that went on a trip with Brown. Uh, you went where? Morris Jamal Madison. Oh, this is what? What? What is this location? Oh. Uh, Location is on here. I'm gonna give you guys for you don't have to show no, no, you don't have to show me. I don't have to show you? You don't oh. have to. Go back go back to the video. Okay, go back to the video. I'm gonna see where oh here we are. I'm gonna see where Morris Jumbo Madison tutorial. Roger Morris. Uh yeah, talk about for Mark Roger Morris. On those history that give it for a tour. They also went to the See what else you got. I think it is on here. Let me just give it this for search. I just want to. Unexpected of Kyle. You yeah. have hundreds of videos. Oh, hundreds. Right. Also, also the polo grounds too for the baseballs. Morris, Joel, Madison. It, yep, they are. They are here. Sixty-five Jamal Torrance, New York, New York, one zero zero three two. That's where, but that's why I just recorded at Donna Rosen last September twenty first, two thousand and nineteen. So it was a proud trip that you guys right. went on, right? So you could you can make your own stories about Donna Rosen on your on your on your profile for for. Living with autism so with Michael Levin, if you able want to telling telling the stories, but it is completely up to you. Just like I said, I hear, I hear you, Kyle. But I told you, you make better videos than I do. I can never make long videos like that. My subscribers don't like it, but your subscribers liked it. Hmm. Um, really, quite sure, but everyone loves my subscribers and the viewers. I, I try I usually kept posting every day and night. Hopefully it does like right anyway, so any questions let me know in the comments below on the Zoom video communication about remembering Donna Rosen for the long time sprout participant and then have have some have something for conversations, and hope hopefully 
I like Michael going to do the stories about David Rosen. Or oh, no, not David, Donald Rosen. I can push that word. Yeah. Can I take this for Michael Lett and Kyle? Uh, right. Okay. Oh, there you are. Hey, Michael, you just came here. Take this from Michael Lettman, Kyle. I feel bad that others have abandoned you. I don't want to be rude, but no, I don't want to sound rude, I mean. I think you, you kindly invited others to this meeting, and only I showed up. Yet, others were too busy to attend. But, but I feel like they abandoned you. Well, actually, no, of course they wouldn't abandon you. They were just too busy to attend or something. I mean, they could have said something good for Donald, who need to be remembered from Sprout. He lived a good life. He didn't deserve to die. Well, we all know it's the virus's fault. Hmm? What can we do? It happens. You want to make sure to wear the yellow face mask, then the face guards, and then the rubber gloves. And then also, don't forget to use the hand sanitizer. Just, just what we got to say about for the Andrew Cuomo saying on the on the press briefing. So I'm gonna so I'm gonna make sure of that anyway. So guys, if you have any, so you can follow Michael Lemon on on his YouTube profile. I'm gonna put that link below in the description box and to see what little autism. Excuse me, Living with Autism by Michael Lemon. And like I, and then I always remember about here for that to, um, you know, Joy Land and Masaki, you know, right next to um, Donald Rosen's. I went to the, you know, museum, any, any museums that we, that we prefer that. So, so Michael, if you want to, make the stories about Donna Wilson, if you can, it is completely up to you, but, but thank you so much, Michael. I really appreciate it. Um, no problem, Kyle. And hello, Kyle viewers, subscribers, and followers. I am Michael Lettman of Living with Autism by Michael Lettman, my project on autism. And of course, I understand that viewers like you appreciate Kyle Wu and it's excellent work on news and entertainment. He makes excellent videos for you every single day. Every time he has a video, he posts it on his channel. He does work on his Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram, and voila, he has excellent work for all of you to enjoy every single day. That's Kyle's channel's motto. New videos will be published every day. Yes, and that's why he right now has over 400 subscribers, and I won't be surprised if he gets to 500 sooner than I think. Yeah, but my channel has a long way to go be as good as his channel. I'm doing my best to get back to work for my subscribers. I need to do my best for the autistic community, especially Sprout. I feel bad for Donald. He didn't deserve to die. He just, the virus got to him and, it, and he tried to fight it, but he lost. But that's why Sprout will make sure that Donald Rosen will never ever be forgotten. And I wish some Sprout leaders were here to get some good words for the one person who needs to be remembered. And I'm gonna hope that the rest of Sprout can survive the virus long enough to see if life will ever go back to normal. But with the virus around still taking over, I'm not sure what's gonna happen in 2021. Hmm. We'll see how that works for the next year. So Michael, thank you so much. And for Living with Autism by Michael Lemon. And so I'll see if we're I'll see you soon as possible on the Zoom video communication for that. But thank you very much, Michael. You're welcome, Kyle Wu. All right, thank you so much, Michael. And well, I'll see you. I'll see you later. Sure, that's all. All right. Take care. Okay, bye. All right, so I'm going to back to me on the speaker view and. See what you have for this. All right. Okay, so, well, so what's your story about for Donald Rosen to get this for the memory, just like French Miller did? So, 
if you have any questions for the stories about Donald Wilson for the long time Scrap participant, caught his battle of the COVID-19 pandemic, write me in the comments below. We will always record sharing. You want me to, you want to make sure to subscribe to my channel on my YouTube. You have to follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Sing, 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 Sing Weibo, even LinkedIn. I'm gonna put I'm gonna put my social media on the link below on YouTube. And then make sure, always remember to subscribe to my channel for White Campus News and Entertainment. Don't forget to click the bell to see all notifications about new videos and the latest video. Just be strong. Be safe, stay home, stay healthy. Do not die. And we hope you enjoy. We're, we're all going to miss Donald Rosen, that he just got passed away. And CBS News Show, so they well know, didn't come here for this week. But, well, thank you so much for watching. Special thanks to the Zoom Radio Communications for his or maybe like your Zoom media. So as always, thank you very much for watching and I'll see you next time. Good night.